Hi, Brain Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just to let you know about a couple of new options that Microsoft is testing regarding the Web Copilot, which is found in the sidebar and side panel of Microsoft Edge, as many of you will know. And the Web Copilot in Edge and the Windows 11 Copilot that's found on the Windows 11 desktop are almost one and the same thing. And unfortunately, I cannot show you this video on my Windows 11 device because Edge Canary on that device is not playing the game today and seems to be suffering from one of these unexplainable canary bugs which is common because the browser is very unstable so um, read the fact that I'm showing you this on Windows 10. Now the new options that Microsoft is testing in Edge Canary 121 which is the latest preview version are being able to resize and unpin the Edge Copilot pane and actually pin that to your desktop. So already in Edge, we can already resize the um, Web Copilot. But Microsoft's going to take this one step further where we will actually be able to unpin the Copilot and attach it to the desktop and then be able to resize it. And this is a new version called 2.1 of Edge Copilot that Microsoft, as mentioned, is testing in Edge Canary 121, the latest preview version. Now, Currently, it's not a default feature and it's still very early days. So if you want to test this version 2.1 of the Edge Copilot, we have to use a command line flag. Now, this is the command line flag, which I'll leave uh, down below in the description for you to copy and paste because that's quite a mouthful. But nonetheless, um, how we apply a command line flag is we right click on a shortcut, any shortcut of Edge Canary. And then we head to properties. And as I've mentioned quite a few times on this channel, after the .exe quotations, you leave a space and then you enter the command line flag. If there's anything there prior to entering the flag, you just delete it. So .exe quotations, leave a space and then enter that command line flag. Hit apply, OK, and then just close and reopen the browser. Now, unfortunately, at this stage, even though that command line flag is supposed to enable uh, the Web Copilot version 2.1, in Edge Canary, it's not working. So maybe you'll have better luck than me. But nonetheless, uh, just to demonstrate, if we head over to a GIF once again provided by Leo, this will give us a good idea as more or less what to expect. So if we just have a quick look at this, here we can see that after adding the command line flag uh, to the shortcut, Edge Copilot will open pinned to the desktop and then you can resize it and unpin it. So um, this is a feature now being tested in version 121 of Microsoft Edge. And just to play that one more time, so there we go, you click on Copilot, there we go, it opens it up on your desktop, uh, detached and unpinned from the browser, and then you can click on Unpin Side Pane and there we go and you can then resize it. And I think um, this is a nice handy feature. Um, Especially as an example, if you are running Windows 10, where um, currently Copilot is not available um, for the desktop. And uh, um, very also similar to what we get in Microsoft Edge for Windows 10, the Detach from Edge, which actually detaches the sidebar and places that on the desktop. But nonetheless, I'll keep a close eye on this one. And it's still early days. And as mentioned, that command line flag, I tried it a couple of times, not working for me. And that is quite common with these very early experimental features using these command line flags. So go check that out for yourself. See if you can get it to work. But just wanted to bring it to your attention that uh, Microsoft is testing those uh, new options to be able to unpin and then resize Copilot, um, the Edge Copilot pane in Edge Canary version 121. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.